I was pretty sure we'd find it somewhere down here. Now you know what we're looking for. Something sad and sulking, licking lingering wounds. <laughs> if it's here. She's totally gonna feed us to something awful down here. I know it. Should we expect to fight? Probably. You guys aren't very good at the whole de-escalation thing. It doesn't matter what's down here. If it can bring us back our grumpy Catathian, I'm all in. And the rest of you should be too. Come on, guys. We're the freaking guardians of the galaxy. <laughs> um, is that supposed to be me? I heard you make that speech so many times. And then Gamora says something like, We're going to need Drax? Uh-huh. And then little Fuzzy says, Nope, I ain't playing this game. And then Little Fuzzy usually says, If I get eaten, I'm gonna be real pissed, Quill. That does sound like me. <laughs> Nobody ever gets eaten. Is that another giant face? It's not. It looks like a giant egg. We're here. Home of the healing light. Source of the cure. Oh. Origin of Raker's power. It's a cocoon? Told you she was gonna feed us to some giant bug. Or maybe she's the bug, and that's some kind of external digestion sack or something. <laughs> you realize this is weird, right? Oh, it gets weirder. I'm looking forward to it getting weirder, I guess. Source of Raker's power. That's weird, though. So is this actual faith energy stuff, or...? Oh, gross. Please tell me Drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack. So the shepherds found fresh flock. Ah! Ah! Foolish followers. Is this Adam Warlock? Fast beard butt. Wow. You know not the gravity of your treacherous trespass. You cannot quell a god. Prepare for oblivion, interloper. Oh, what's this one? Okay, Green Rainy, you're up. <sighs> Found you. What wayward wickedness is this? Nasty uglies from that busted noggin of yours. Okay, guys, it's him, Aaron Witchcraft. No, wait, Aiden Warsock. Ashley Warsock. Adam Warlock. That's it, the Golden God guy. Hold on, this guy's Raker's old divine, whatever. Looks pretty good for a dead guy. Were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd? Us? With Raker, not a chance. We're trying to shut his ass down. See, friends. Okay, big guy, and we go. Come on! All the ones where we die already happen. Well, that didn't surprise me that Adam Warlock's alive. They did say he was like the only oh. one who has a chance to stop things. <sighs> Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas. Her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue-skinned model. So... Can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. Ugh, can someone translate this guy? He said no. What protection I can proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Oh, is she gonna mind jack all of us? Whoa, wait, let, let's talk about... What the... 
but it's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Whoa. Welcome to the Astral Plains, Snorlord. You teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. That looks Merger, fun. What? I gave no consent to this planescaper. She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, god guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess. What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Yeah, what is the problem here? I thought it was all just Mind Stone stuff. How is Adam Warlock's power involved? I also legitimately don't know fucking jack all about this guy, so like... <laughs> I don't know what so, the fuck he's gonna uh, do. none of this is real... Uh, guys? Is that... Drax? Hi, Groot. So we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him, and convince him to come back to reality. Oh boy. Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Much deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, listen to Amy Winsaw. She means you. Quite clearly. Yeah, sure, we can... We can go to Drax's mine and try and fix him up. Convince him about the promise not really being possible. Even though, technically, it probably is. The Infinity Stones are kind of like the Dragon Balls from... Dragon Ball Z. He could just kind of gather them all and get some crazy power and create some shit. Bring everybody back or go into another Have timeline. Have you done this before, Mantis? Mantis? Watching me sleep. <laughs> I can't walk anywhere, so we're just kind of here. Um, I, am I supposed to be doing something? I feel like I'm still supposed to be able to walk and go right into the light. Mouse and keyboard didn't work. Oh my god, you moved the camera so fast with that. Um, huh. Second biggest? What's the first? Oh, right. How could I forget about nowhere? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're gonna reload the checkpoint. Something's supposed to happen there, and it didn't. What the butt? It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Welcome to the Astral Plains, Snorlord. You teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. Merged our what? I gave no consent to this planescaper. She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, god guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess! What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Uh, guys? Is that Drax? Hi, Groot. So we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him and convince him to come back to reality. Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Much deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, listen to Amy Winsaw. She means you. Quite clearly. I think something different happened this time. Huh. Nice. What? This is Drax's promise? Mine was a lot less... downery. This is just the doorstep. The poor guy was stuck here, reliving the loss of his family. Your friend's fear and pain primed him as prey. What do you know about it, Goldilocks? More than I mind. 
Drax dug all these? The epitaphs are all inscribed Hovat and Camaria. You can read that junk? All elocution is native to my tongue of truth. I am Groot. I am Groot. Y you can speak Groot? That may be the weirdest thing about you so far. <laughs> did he actually, did Groot understand what he said in I am Groot? <laughs> That There's is a pretty cool glue. power. That was easy. This is just an echo, little fuzzy. Part of poor Greenie can never stop digging until he accepts what's buried. Aw. <laughs> poor Drax. Uh, I'm not the only one that hears that, right? <laughs> we got a runner. After a spotlight. I don't know this part. Drax. <laughs> All right, jumping in after him. Drax? <laughs> Not Drax. Thanos. Bet you weren't expecting a family reunion, eh, Gamora? I'm about to enjoy this. Uh, okay, I was about to say, I can't move. Mega ability unlocked, five barrel barrage. Conquering his dramatic fear of water to save his friends to free, uh, freed Rocket from all his restraints. He'll now gleefully reveal the entirety of his massive arsenal and bombard enemies with bullets, missiles, and projectiles. The result is massive damage to a target area. Cool. Holy mother of god! I actually looked at the video and, wow, that's crazy. After all, something's not right. You fail to fathom the rules of this realm. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Okay, that's new. That's new, right? I think I'd remember there being two of them. Twice the ugly, twice the target wreck. <laughs> what the hell? Even more of them? <laughs> Stop fighting, but our health is low. Am I supposed to get my ass knocked down first? I don't know. What else are we supposed to do? Block. Yeah, that's fair. What would I do without you, Rocket? It is a destined defeat. Whose side are you on? Hey. Peter? Whoa! Hey, what's happening? That's it! That's why I couldn't see! Oh, I had to get my butt kicked. Uh. Hey, we ain't dead. Mantis, I think we did something, but I don't see Drax. Mantis? Your soothsayer holds no sway here. Trespassers on tainted land. Guess that means we're in the right place. <laughs> oh, good. Not creepy at all. Hold up. Look. I bet I could beat you to the center. Are you so keen to usurp your father, little one? You're scared to race me. I only fear you disappoint in this lesson. Always study your surroundings. And have you? These walls carry the history of our people. They're just stories. You're stalling. Much more than that. Let's see if you've been paying attention. If she's paying attention, she'll be able to do her race faster, That's you know? So fast, little one. Drax, wait up! Wait, what's over here? 
Are there going to be fucking components in the mine? Because that would be... Hey, as well. There he is again! Drax, buddy! Wait up! Forced to follow fools. <laughs> Whoa! Damn it. I can hear you the boy on a board built by your opponent. You got a better idea? I'm all ears. Yeah, Adam Warlock, stop fucking being annoying. Oh, assuming we ever catch him, what then? I'm working on that. Left, little wife. Huh? You can see me? He's too far fallen to be willed back by words. For someone who's been no help, you seem full of opinions on how this works. <laughs> There! Look! <laughs> Adam Wallace hey, is stuck on the path. Because <laughs> I am your father. You've been playing in your mother's garden again. I was hunting. Hunting dirt? No, I chased it, but it was too quick. Only fools rush forward. A hunter waits. Chooses her moment. Drax. <clears throat> Papa? Are you alright? Drax, Camaria, it is time to come home. What the flock is that? Yes, little one. Your mother waits. Insidious succubus! Release your thrall! Kansas anymore. The Clark are those! Spawn of shadow! Snuff their source while I widen our They're way! They're coming from those nests! Yeah, sure, I'll take out all these little critters. Oh! I don't have- oh, wow. I just learned something new. Uh, I've been pressing the Guardians button and then left stick for Peter's abilities. But apparently, all you have to do is left stick. That actually gets rid of a little, like, I, I had a grievance about that. I was a little annoyed. I was like, that's a lot of button presses to do my cool shit. Whatever's keeping us from Drax. You saw simply its spawn. That black stuff. I saw something like it in my promise. There will be more. We have merely moved deeper within its domain. Speaking of which, is that Drax's wife? I think so. Hovat. Then this must be Drax's home. Hey, sorry to intrude, but we actually need our buddy back. You two certainly took your time. Only fools rush. Come, my love. Let us go inside. Drax, buddy. Your words are wasted, wind. Easy, all right. I got this. Come on, big guy. I know you can hear me. Why do you haunt me? We're gonna lose him again. It's me, buddy. Stormlord, remember? We're all here. You're stronger than this, Drax. Come on, you big luck. Don't leave me alone with Quill. <laughs> Drax, dinner is ready. That's not Hovat. You gotta let her go. You do not know what you ask. Gotta destroy more of the spawn things? Yeah, okay. Oh, there's five of them this time. That's fun. Alright, it's two down! Hey, 
hey, I'm working on it. I'm also trying to get, you know, boosts and points, maybe. see any new promise at least we are an empty eternal echo naked nothingness not helping hobo wizard all right everyone just split up and look for a way out or forward or whatever i lose a bet if i die in a dark pit it was alone in a dark pit drax come on buddy i know you can hear me this ain't flarkin funny i know you're in a dark place right now literally but we're not gonna give up just point us in the right direction. There! Look! Oh. I can't believe that worked. Let's go. Part of him is still with us, I'm sure of it. The light! I we must follow it. hell of a speech plan, Peter. That makes two of us. We've made it to the center. Drax himself. Maybe. Why are you doing this? Do not leave me be. You gotta trust us, Drax. We're trying to help. By destroying my home. Your blissful ignorance is in ignoble pursuit. Easy, Shakespeare. We got this. Come on. You don't really want to stay in this dark hole? I would endure the depths of Sarduth to be with my family. Drax, love. It is time to eat. I get it, man. They seem really special. They are the only thing that matters. My Hovat. Was the most fearless mate I have ever known. She brought me peace even during times of war. My Camaria. My innocent little Camaria. She was the best of us both. Despite her meager stature, they both were. were. My family is gone. What sits before me? I don't know. But it's not real. It ain't good. It is a perversion. Fed by desperation. Without it... I will have nothing. I cannot be alone again. You're not alone, man. We're here for you. We've all lost someone, Drax. But it gets easier if you surround yourself with the right people. I am Groot. Uh, Groot said some mushy stuff. Let's just pretend I said it too. We're a team. Papa? Are you okay? We didn't tell him the part where he's gonna have to thrash his family to get rid of them. Maybe he won't have to. It's not her.
Are you hurt, Papa? Talk to us, love. cherish the time that we had, and not resent the time that we lost. <gasps> Shall love and honor you both, always. How you doing, big guy? You okay? I am of sound mind, thanks to you all. I owe amends for my lapse in judgment. Hey, you don't owe us squat. Ain't none of us perfect. It's kind of our thing. <laughs> How much do you remember? Great darkness grew with every lie that I swallowed. The longer I remained with my family, the more certain I became that I could never leave. You quill. Your child is in danger. If her pain is half my own, the darkness may consume her entirely. Not if I can help it. We gotta be smart about this. There's a whole lot of converted between us and her. A whole lot of that black dwarf, too. And anyone wanna tell me why Harry Hobo was able to suck it up? More than why that thing looked like him. Because it is me. That's a sick outfit. I missed the beard, though. Time to go. Okay, are we going to be able to get to the core of what's really going on? Hey, Goldie Braun! Want to get back here and explain that bombshell? Time is tight and your understanding unimportant. Can I shoot him? Come on, let me shoot him. <laughs> eh, that first fight don't count. Look, I don't know what's going on, but it's clear this is at least a little bit your fault. My contrition is clear, as is my resolve to rectify my recklessness. Hey, we get reckless. It's kind of our brand. We're all on the same team. We've got to work together. I am in favor of this plan. Goldie Braun seems capable, despite his ridiculous name. <laughs> Imagine ambivalent omnipotence drifting in darkness. Uh, speaking of dark... Such was my celestial solitude. Power without purpose, until uncovered by Raker. His crew were convalescent. Plagued by a pox, I was serendipitously suited to soothe. A ship full of sick people just happens upon someone with limitless healing? We were need and needed, symptom and solace. We worshipped the wonder of my ways and declared me divine. I think we know where this is going. I do not know where this is going. This is the scary part? As the flock of followers fawned, a dark delight developed deep within me. And in the shadows it spoke. Weak whelps, pernicious priesting, feeble fools, fit for feasting. Hubris made hunger. A cancerous craving called Magus. What did it want? Complete devotion. I too heard this voice and could hear nothing else. Adulation. Flagellation, gorged with grief and consternation. 
I told you this was the scary part. It was pure putrefaction. Sown from the seed of my strength. My soul stone gone sour. I resolved to rip it out. Rip it out? How? A mechanical marvel wrought by Raker would sever the stone from my skull and excise the evil entangled within. Translation, you let Raker steal your powers. Whatever his wayward wander, he was on that day my friend. He swore to separate sanctity from sin, that my healing could yet be harnessed without harm. Sure, but who's harnessing it? Okay, all right. Uh... I don't really, really care to blame either of them. I kind of just want to hear where this is going. Um, blame Sounds Warlock. like you were careless. Deluded by desperation. My mind was melding with Magus. Did it work at least? In a savage sense. Split my soul in twain and cast us to the cosmos. So, no. For me, there was only darkness. I awoke half whole. Certain the stone shattered. How Magus merged with another I know not. I think I can answer that. After I rejected my promise, I got pulled into Nikki's. Bro was there. She was trying to show me something. Peter, you can't trust anything you saw in there. This was different, and it felt different. She took me back to the QZ, and I saw that Magus thing. I saw it get all twisted up with Nikki, and I. I saw it kill Corel. You hear yourself? How'd she show you this if she's dead? Quite conceivably. Her soul may be snared by the stone, chained to the child. That's what Corel said. The three of them are somehow connected. She said Nikki needs to accept her death. Magus preys upon her pain, manipulates her mind while feeding on her flock of followers. And I'm guessing it never gets full. Its appetite is insatiable. If unassailed, Magus will absorb all. We're gonna need one hell of a plan. Well, you better come up with it quick, because I see daylight. The bond between Magus and Matriarch must be broken. It harvests its hunger through the host. So... Nikki's like the head vampire. If we cure her, it'll free the rest. Why didn't you just say that? <laughs> I mean, I feel like that was an obvious one. So step one, find Nikki. Step two, convince her mom ain't coming back from the dead. Step three, get that stone away from her and mop the floor with that Magus thing. You show no shortage of assurance. Yeah, this one's Mr. Positivity. It's enough to make you sick. The stone is both bondage and bridge for Magus, and a young mind is most malleable. If Magus is merged with her, she may not survive the severing. We won't let it come to that. Not to join the Golden Downer, but how are we supposed to find the kid? What are you- What's going- Oh. All the Lark. kid might have found us. Lark. Oh my god. The peaceful priests! No! They've got the Cortex. They can go anywhere. Convert anyone. Oh my god, no. Cosmo! Uh, hey, Nikki! Chapter 12, Nowhere to Run. To go now. Why does that sound like you're not coming with us? These are my people. Some still survive if I stay. Then we'll stay and help. Go. I'll be where I'm needed when I need to be. Just trust me. Don't go dying. On me. I'm starting to actually get you. back to our ship fast. Wow. I thought we were going to have to fight along the planet.
You wanna pop a squat, golden boy? You're making me nervous. Or perhaps your nerves need gnawing. What did I do? This precarious plan proves more meek by the moment. The Madonna was meant to be among us. She knows what she's doing. Eventually. What sorry sins I have wrought to rest me among such a motley crew. He's gonna use my room too? Did Jesus. He... Did he take my room? Not so much as a yip from the mud. Groot says he'll keep trying. Where's Mr. Fancy Words? It has assumed Peter Quill's quarters. It was a daring display of dominance. Don't you start. <laughs> Usually I'd say who needs him, but we do. So you better fix this one, Quill. Just try not to piss him off any more than he already is. If it is to be a fight to the death, I will honor the outcome. If he kills you, I get your guns. Oh, jeez. All right, well, we've got on Adam Warlock. Fight. Took all five of us to beat him last time. I still can't believe he caught one of my smart bombs. Just like that. We have already fought the man. Hold on. You don't remember? I remember sparring against the Celestial Madonna in a small village. And then the cold darkness of the promise devouring my soul. Until you found me. Yeah, you missed a lot. <laughs> that's that's kind of on uh, Mantis, right? Because she she mind jacked him. He was probably asleep in that. Oh, but okay, we've got Adam Warlock. We've got an idea of and <clears throat> my shoulders. A lot of things sore. to solve. Yeah, Mantis is heavier than she looks. How is she connected with my soreness? <laughs> she rode your back all the way down the caves to Goldie's place. Really. Yeah, we're going to take a bit of a break here because it is getting late and I'm getting tired.